everyone. I hope you are doing well. Incredible move on the NASDAQ today. This is one of the biggest moves that I ever seen on a micro. Look at our runner. Incredible. So number one, we are 409 on the 11. I need to get out so that uh, I don't breach the rules uh, to get out before the market close. close. See, the market are about to close. So I need to close this. And we bought this thing at 18,769 on one micro, one mini micro. And look now, it's almost 500 points away. And it's close to our target. Our target was there all day. So I need to move the target and get out. But I wanted to show you this incredible trade that we uh, held all day. And then I'll explain the trade. So let me get it out so that I am on the time for the platforms. Modify there. And voila, we got it. We canceled the stop loss, the TP, and we got the money. So this was an incredible runner. Actually, there's an entire video that I posted about why you should trade prop firms here when you have the time go on the day trading zones channel i just released that video for everyone like about like an four minutes ago we filmed it like an hour ago so this is going to help you guys understanding this trade but now that i close the trade and i'm more relaxed let me explain the reason of entry number one see here the cloud the power indicator cloud each time it's purple, that's a short. Each time it turns blue like this, it's a long, right? So that's number one. Number two, I have net buyer, net sellers for me. So you see, they were going down, down, down. Volume indicator, power volume indicator went up all afternoon, net buyer, net buyers, which you see here. Institutional net buyer, major net buyer, minor net buyer, trend up, long-term trend up, big blocks here as well so short term align with the long term align guess what does that do that is a super huge confirmation of going long and staying long so you'll see in the video i made like a thousand two hundred or whatever but now that i've closed the the stuff here right uh this ended up being 1,972. As a matter of fact, I'll show you the stats for the day. Well, take a picture of the stats, which I'm looking as we look now, as I just closed my last contract. And we'll go over those stats. But again, all of this was using the probability power indicator. So let's go over the stats and see if the stats are going to uh, help you understand a little bit what we've done today. So in the morning, I was looking for longs, two longs, and then it shut down, shut down, shut down. But I was up about 389, 400 bucks with the guys in the live room. And then I went for a run and I come back and I saw, I'll show you the institutional support. So at the end of the day, like I did 20 trades, I had 14 winners, six losers, which is a great winning ratio. For me, I mean, for any trader, 70% win ratio for on 20 trades is really, really good. You know, even some days I do 45, 50, 52, and I'm still doing very well. Today was a 70%. And look at this, the entire cumulative stuff, up, 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 up all day. The p &L story, up, 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 up all day. You know, there was those little crack there and there, but even that, I'm trying to look, it was 91, 91 bucks I was looking at. So this is this is really, really cool day. And again, because you are user of the probability power indicator, watch the day trading zones video. But in a nutshell, look at all the synergies. Look at all the synergies. I come from for the institutional red zones right there. Like, see, up. So our institutional red block is right there at 571, which I blocked it. 
And if you notice tonight, where I got out of the runner at the top just before the close here, look here, same here. That's the target rate to rate institutional block. Same here, you can see it on the 15 minute chart on the left. Here's the block with the rate institutional and at the bottom, same. So I went from institutional to institutional. I used the two calculator huge support, buy on blue, sell on purple, and net buyers here. Net buyers, blue cloud, blue uptrend, institutional buyers, major buyers, minor buyers, both on the long-term and short-term trends. So such a wonderful $900, $900 on one MNQ. That means that if this was a full NQ, this would have been $9,000. That being said, it's fine. Like I showed you, I'll take the win for the day. It was uh, um, the uh, almost $2,000. And by the way, just that you know, guys, <laughs> I placed a trade. I left the bracket and I went for a run. I went for some food shopping and I came back and closed the bracket. So hopefully that was helpful. You know, it's a quick recap on how we nailed this trade with the probability power indicator, buy on blue, sell on purple, institutional red zone to red zone, switch of the cloud from purple to blue buyers and net buyers, net buyers, net buyers on the volume indicator and on the power trend box at the top. Hopefully that was helpful. Take care, everyone. And I'll see you in the next video. I will try to do a stream tomorrow, Thursday at 4.15. Otherwise, I'll see you next week, every Wednesday, 4.15 p.m., Wealth Wednesday. And don't forget, every week we have one or two videos that we post on our other channel, Day Trading Zones. Take care, everyone. Have a great day. Hopefully that was helpful.